Hi guys, I appreciate you clicking this video. My name is Flex. Today I have a pretty exciting opportunity for you. It's different from the norm on the channel. We post remote jobs on the channel as well as career growth tips and hacks. Today's opportunity or lead is with the Federal Aviation Administration. So this is a United States federal lead as an air traffic controller. It's different from what we normally talk about on this channel, but I thought it's a great opportunity and I'll make a video on it, especially for people who are looking for high paying jobs in 2023. So we're going to look at this one in a second. As far as the pay goes, it's very high pay. Like I said, as much as $164,000 is what you can make as a air traffic controller and it's with the federal government so you know that comes with a lot of benefits this one isn't remote like we usually talk about on the channel but like i said i was excited about this opportunity for people who can get in and grow a career it's all about you know growing a career getting a high paying job and supporting yourself supporting your family even if it's not remote which is the norm that we talk about on this channel so Getting on with it, again, this is with the Federal Aviation Administration, the United States government, and they're hiring FAA air traffic controllers. The portal for this, for this year, is May 5th to May 8th, so just under a week, and it's coming up here next week, so you definitely want to have your applications ready and don't miss out on this opportunity. The FAA is actually hosting three live events where interested applicants can talk to people who are current air traffic controllers and hiring specialists and they have the dates listed here now the dates are actually very close to the opening portal window where you can actually apply or when they're actually accepting applications so if you want to be ready to be an air traffic controller and learn how to apply you can join the webinar here here's how to attend via youtube so you can literally just click link and watch it on May 2nd, 2 p.m. Eastern time. And live Q&A on Instagram will be held on their Instagram website on Wednesday, May 3rd, as well as air traffic control application and training workshop on May the 4th via Zoom. So this is actually great opportunities that they're giving you to learn from current air traffic controllers and different things on how to actually apply. So the 2023 application window is May 5th to May 8th, who actually can apply you must be a united states citizen for one usually we have a lot of people on the channel saying they want remote jobs that are global worldwide and we've posted quite a few of those as a matter of fact i have done a series the past four videos on work from home jobs that you can do pretty much anywhere in the united states or around the world so this one is for united states citizens only and you must be registered for selective service if applicable so these are people born after december 1959 if you were born after december 1959 in the united states you automatically have to register for selective service especially when you turn 18 years of age so you got to be registered for selective service and you got to be younger than 31 years of age before the closing date so before may 8th you got to be younger than 31 years of age so if on may 9th or if on may 8th you are 32 you cannot apply you gotta have either three years of general work experience so you can be coming from sales you can be coming from uh, finance you can be coming from anywhere you can be coming from growth you know customer service whatever it is just three years of general work experience or four years of education leading to a bachelor's degree or a combination of both and if you can speak English and be willing to relocate to the FAA Federal Aviation Administration facility based on agency staffing needs, then that would be great for you as well. Then note here that it's a tough job. If you got what it takes, then you should go ahead and apply. The link is down below as always, so you can learn more and apply. Again, this is an awesome opportunity to get in and make some serious money with a career in the federal government. And I really just wanted to bring this to your attention real quick if you are not if you have not heard about it so application process is right here if you expand that you will see that if you meet the bet the basic qualifications that we just listed above and pass the air traffic skills assessment and achieve a score within a certain percentile then you can move on so you will have up to three and a half hours to complete the test in person on an approved testing facility i assume they have testing facilities all over the united states so you got to go in take this three and a half hour test completed with an accepting percentile then 
you can be able to move on. So if you pass a medical and security clearance, so drug testing, class two medical physical exam, fingerprinting, background checks, different things that they're actually going to check you for because you're going to be cleared. This is a very important job. It's an air traffic controller with a federal aviation administration. So that's a little bit about the application process. I would say the highest barrier of entry here is that three and a half hour exam. Other than that, if you are pretty clean as far as background goes and with drugs, you can be able to pass this and get a security clearance, which can help you in other fields, other careers down the line. So something to take serious. As far as training goes, I'm excited about this one because training is actually paid. As they note here, while attending the academy, trainees receive thirty-four dollars to $35,000 paid in Oklahoma City per diem for living expenses. So you got to travel to Oklahoma, you will be paid $35,000 per diem. So it can go up to $43,000 plus lo locality paid for certain facilities assigned to people. So that's something to really consider if you're going to move to Oklahoma to tr get trained you actually be paid for it. And of course, like we said, the salary can go up to $164,000 a year and the training is paid. So that's as far as pay goes. This is the federal government. Benefits are always pristine. And there's more that you can learn here as far as eligibility go. And if you are ready to apply, the link for this is down below. I do hope you would take advantage of this free webinars that they're having within these three days to ask questions from people who are current air traffic controllers. Learn if you're interested, learn if you qualify, learn if it's something that you actually want to do. And I do hope you will pursue this if you're interested. So something different from what we talk about the channel uh, recently, as far as remote jobs go, just wanted to bring a high paying job to your attention, something that you can jump in and get involved with if you're a united states citizen or if you know one who will be interested in this definitely share this video if not just hit the thumbs up button so youtube can do its magic and spread it all around i do appreciate you watching hope you enjoyed the video because i enjoyed making it and i will see you on the next one peace